Um, that doesn't work very well, does it? Um, okay, that's fine. We'll just have to leave that section for now. Okay. So we'll give that a bit of time and then we should mine this up in no time. Actually, it's one and a half million. So, might last us a little bit. Oh, getting attacks here. Also, they're not even touching. Oh. Yeah, touched the wall there. They did 22 damage. Not bad. So, is this the size of the entire map? This. Oh, no, there might be more. I wonder how big the actual map is. Maybe I should just travel north and see what happens. Where's my car? <laughs> Did I lose my car? No, it's right there. But I'm over here. So it's not very helpful. Come on. Gotta be full. Close to full. Yeah, very close. Oh, waited. Ah, nice. And I'll stop it there. I think the key to getting off a moving train is just press, just get out the train, and then don't do anything until the train passes by. Yeah, this is the side of curiosity. I'm just gonna like, save here so we can come back down. I just wanna see how big this map is. I'm just gonna go north. They even have ammo in my car. A kit, little nest here. Oh, and a rock. <sighs> Worst enemy in the game, rocks. There's no real nice grassy areas in this map, is there? Or are they? At least not close by. Oh, there's some grass. Whoa, that's a pretty big nest. Oh, there we go. Here's some nice green. Why do we have a base here? It's a nice place to be. Wow. These are pretty big. Almost as big as the one to my other map. Ah, crap. Let's see if we can get around these nests. Um, not easily, no. Hmm. <laughs> wow, that's the biggest one so far, I think. Enemies on the map? Wait, I didn't see any enemies. Ooh, night vision. Oh, I'm actually dying. 
Those bugs? Are those enemies? Oh, I'm sure they're friendly. They just want to welcome me. Whee! <laughs> am I tempting fate? Oh, yes I am. Ah! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ah, okay. Well, that was fun. Let's just turn around from here. I know, I was just going to save my other save. I mean, load my other save. I found the mother load, yeah. Ah, yeah. I would really want to mine some upgrades for my car, but I don't know actually if there are any. At least I haven't noticed any. That's not saying much, though. It's kind of like saying corporations don't notice global warming. Ah! Okay, let's actually load my other game. I need more. I need better munitions. Let's make some repairs on here. We actually need to automate repairs on the wall. There we go. So what are we actually doing next? Oh, hello. Gonna watch these guys die, that's what. We definitely need more walls, I think. Um, yeah, we're out of. Oh, there's one thing I wanted to get. I want to make some exoskeleton stuff. This stuff. Oh, okay, we're going to need processing units and electrical engine units. So... Let's get started on that. So, uh, electrical engine units probably going to require sulfur and, you know, this all sort. Oh, lubricant. Interesting. It requires heavy oil, and heavy oil requires... Water and heavy oil? No. Advanced oil processing. Water and crude oil. Made in the oil refinery. I didn't get it. Where's the heavy oil then? Is it out of the other outputs? Or do I have to like... Actually select it? Yes. So... That's getting filled up with crude oil, and we'll need some water. There's a pipe. Ah, uh, crap. There we go. Let's do that. Oh wait, that's not water. My bad. Could also just use this. And then we'll put a pipe here. Make this go across. Ech. Um, we need to go up a little. That's just not done well. <laughs> 
it's light in the way as well. There we go. Now we're getting three different products, so this is going to be a little fun. Amen. We can connect that up. So the heavy oil, we need to send it off to a chemical plant. Maybe to the left here. Uh, yeah, that sounds like an idea. Ah, oh, crap. Of course. What's this? An electric furnace. Oh, nice. That sounds pretty cool. That don't require coal at all. Yeah, nice. Um... Let's see the other stuff first, the ones that don't have new items, because then I won't hopefully hopefully I won't forget as much. So I'm probably gonna need to move this. Okay, how's that? That's actually not good. Um, it's too act too close to the crude oil pipe. And every time I remove a pipe, I think I lose some oil. There we go. That's probably better. We can't put that there unless can this go ah oh, man I can't go through pipes eh ah oh, man it was just a little bit further could have gotten that to work yeah I was actually looking through the mods and there's actually a mod with allows you to walk through your pipes. I was like, that's definitely something I need. It sounds incredible. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, light oil. So I'm more than likely going to need silos or something. But we'll see how far I can get without storing every liquid that we actually have. Just go here for now. I have no idea what I'm going to do with you. Because that's light oil, right? Yeah. This crap, though. It's going to a chemical plant. Luckily, I brought some along with me. Oh yeah. Blame on. So now I'm wondering if this light oil gets filled up, it's probably not going to produce any more heavy oil, right? 
I have no idea. So, now we just need an engine unit and electronic circuits. Oof, easier said than done, eh? So our engine units are down here. Um, hmm. Yeah, those are all engine units. <laughs> I love it. We don't need an advanced circuit, we just need a normal electronic circuit. Okay. Easy. Easy pants. Not easy pants. Am I actually going to need a line of electronic... of engines going all the way up there? It certainly looks like that's where we're going. Um, this kind of reminds me of the game my old friend of mine plays, Forge of Empires. It's like Clash of Clans, but you can play without attacking anyone, you can, you can trade people. Okay. Sounds fun. I've really been a fan of Clash of Clans, probably because of all the MTX. But apparently it is a... you can do multiplayer on this thing. I'm not sure how well it works though. There we go. Now we can have another splitter. <laughs> Oh my word, it's ridiculous. This is why I need to rebuild my base. Ah crap, that's not working. Whoops. You don't like how it takes a month to upgrade your walls, but your buildings take a day. Ah, uh, the attack shift wait for uh Yeah, that sounds like rubbish. Typical mobile gaming BS. And the worst thing about mobile games is not like how egregious it is. It's like, for some people, that's their entire experience with gaming. They don't know how like good a game can be. It's like, it's sad, like, thinking that, like, the children growing up now are growing up with microtransactions and all this other BS, and that's becoming the norm for them. Most of your friends prefer a good phone compared to a PC that can actually play games. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's kind of annoying, actually. Um, I came back here for a reason. Oh, underground tracks, that's what, that's what I needed. You can't even play Left 4 Dead 2 with them. <laughs> Shame. Yeah, I don't have many friends who play games at the moment either. I mean, I've got one friend who does, but he usually plays with his girlfriend, and they like playing League of Legends and stuff, which I don't really like, because of how toxic it is, and I just don't like the game itself anyway. But yeah, I'm trying to convince him to play Factorio PvP or PvE. Might be fun. Um, hmm. Were we taking damage? Yeah, can't be. Okay. Anyway, now we just need electronic circuits and then we're good to go. Is Factorio multiplayer? Yes, apparently. I haven't tried it out though. Let me just save. 
There you go. If I host a new game though. Oh, there you go. Wave defense, supply challenge. Buy the production output objects and build your factory to meet the ever increasing demand. Add points for finishing each level and fulfilling the supplies ahead of schedule. Play single player or multiplayer. PvP, team production, sandbox. You build in God mode. Oh wow. Rocket rush. You start with all technologies unlocked, but choosing the starting items carefully try to launch a rocket as fast as possible. So yeah, they actually got quite a few things actually. That's pretty cool. Oh, housing electronic circuits, right? Oh, these are pretty decent, yeah. I should, might, um, maybe I should put some speed modules on these. I need to actually do that as well, automate the speed modules. Hey, Spy, how's it going? Um, hmm. I'm okay, thanks. Thanks for asking. Let's just do it like this. Let's have this creates another abomination. So what's new here? Uh, I've got a new copper train. Whoops. What did I just do? Did I break? Um, here we are. Some more copper production built now that it's not an outpost here. And I'm trying to get some another. I'm trying to get an exoskeleton, so I'm trying to automate electrical engines. Electric engine units, there we go. And beyond that, I don't think there's much. Exoskeletons are so good, makes cars obsolete, kind of. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping. Um. Yeah. I definitely want some more speed. Oof. No! I can remove that, right? Okay, we can actually connect these circuits. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I hope that's the right direction. Think it is? No. <laughs> Um, let's make him curl around. Boom! That should be fine. I hope. So, let's build you, choose the recipe. Stick a pipe in you. And I just realized this is not correct. Also, electronic circuits, right? There we go. The power of the dark side. Okay, so what's the other ingredient for exoskeletons? Processing units. Okay. 
Marathon circuit at 20 electronic circuits and five sulfuric acid. Okay. I've now got sulfuric acid some way. Um, or at least I thought I did. Yeah, isn't it sulfuric acid? Yes. Cool. <laughs> now I have to go back to the bottom. <laughs> uh, sorry guys, I'm dropping a few frames. Hopefully it stabilizes quickly. Or not? Ugh. Yeah, I tried to log a ticket with my ISP, but they haven't gotten back to me. Damn, it's a lot of frames. Uh, weapon shooting speed. We need to... You can do this, actually. Now, is it still yeah, it's still dropping frames? What the hell? This to be stable, more stable at this time of night. <sighs> yeah, how's it on your side, guys? Can you just let me know? Do you mind? Like, is it really bad? Oh, we're taking damage? Where? Yeah, okay. Oh, wow. They're actually getting... It's not that bad anymore? Okay, it still says it's dropping, though. So, I, I do apologize. Just let me know if it gets really bad and I'll stop and carry on tomorrow after I've found my ISP. They haven't gotten back to me yet. <sighs> Ah, wait, it's yellow now, it's stabilizing, and it's green, okay. Little dip in the ocean there. You're not seeing the drops though, I'm not fully paying attention. Ah, thank you for not paying too much attention. <laughs> okay, so we've got circuits here, we can actually... Hmm. You haven't seen the new polluted water? Looks good. Oh yeah. Mmm. Cream soda. Yummy. With extra fizz. This is all the way from the inside onto the out. Okay, so these processing units. Oh, I still need sulfuric acid though. That's the main issue. The narration keeps me focused. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, you're still working. Oh, that sucks, man. Well, hopefully, I'm a good distraction. <laughs> oh, crap. Where is this now? This is at my stone. Okay. Hmm. It'd be nice to get an upgrade to my walls. I had more walls on me, I'd put another layer here. Ah, damn cliffs. Okay, um, sulfuric acid, that's what we were doing. Then I got really distracted. <laughs> um, also, do we need another radar here? Hmm, a bit lower. Yeah. Oh, we're taking damage here, too. Need to be careful. I can make 